Hey guys, what is going on? Jordan here, giving you a gameplay on the map Dome. I did this about a week ago, I think, just after the first video. I'll be using the class setup of PP90M1 with Rapid Fire and Silencer. Secondary is the Stinger to take out enemy aircraft support. I'll be using the Killstreak setup of Attack Helicopter AC-130 and the Beast-like Osprey and I actually achieve it in this game, although I only get to use it for a couple of seconds because it ends. Um, so yeah, the class setup, the perks are Blind Eye Pro, Assassin Pro, and Steady Aim Pro, so I can stay stealth-like and not die. And I'll be using the Throwing Knife, oh no, Frag Grenade that is, yeah, Frag Grenade and Concussion Grenade to get those extra kills. Uh, the reason I'm talking to you today for this video is pretty much, you know, what the guns are like and the kill streak set up, my thoughts on them, and the map, Dome, I love it, it's really, really good, kind of reminds me of Newtown, the smallness of it, and also the gameplay, obviously. Uh, what's in store for you guys in the next weeks will be support, a breakdown video on that obviously with the EMP and the Juggernaut Recon as well as the Escort Airdrop and rem remember guys you can follow us on Facebook link in the description and email us for suggestions and we shall endeavour to deliver what you would like so the PP90 um, it's got a good fire weight fire rate should I say with rapid fire it makes a beast it increases its fire rate by about 33% I believe, which is huge. Although the iron sights actually are not that good. That's something that you need to kind of make yourself around. Should you use red dot? Should you just try and hit fire all the time? Or, you know, don't worry about it and not worry for those long shot guys. Uh, it's pretty bad long range as well. It only does something about 18 points per damage at long range but it does a very good 42 at short and that's why I've got steady aim pro on it's, of course my ridicules are small and something you guys should know is I do not drop shot uh, I can't get the hang of it I'd much rather knife and so yeah now where I'm staying around here guys is very high traffic area I highly advise it though don't be too campish and stay around you know around here oh, and that barrel that's very very dangerous it can explode and kill you uh, the forklifts I don't believe explode though so you can stay around them um, yeah these guys normally come around in that general direction just there so you can stay behind the barrels uh, another thing Sting is taking out the air support. That gives you a point streak and XP. It can be very, very good, guys. Make sure you do that. Attack helicopter is like 200 XP, and it's double XP this weekend for Xbox, anyhow. So um, the kill streak setup. Uh, attack helicopter, besides having no flares, is um pretty good. I'd say it's a long way up there though, so you might want to put predator missile on beforehand or something like that and in fact I only put Osprey Gunner on just this game because I knew it was Dome and I just thought oh have a bit of fun uh, AC-130 um, pretty good there's three weapons if you didn't know there's a 100mm a 20mm and I think something like a 40 I think it's like 40 or 60mm and so that's, it's very competitive against the Pavlo. It has two flares. It's situated high above the battlefield. There's another red barrel just there, making sure you guys know. And of course the Osprey Gunner. Now it is good. It delivers four care packages. And one's a booby trap, making it five. And uh, the cannon is this... Uh, 20 millimeter, kind of like the same in Chopper Gunner for Modern Warfare 2. Um, I wouldn't say it's as good as the Chopper Gunner, and maybe the gunship on Black Ops that was good because it had the rockets. But you know, it's definitely the best. It sits at 17. If you did not know, it's the highest of the assault kill streak. Attack helicopter 7 and AC-130 is 12. And uh, Dome. 
Uh, what do I think of it? Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, guy camping in the jeep over there. It's pretty good dome. Uh, some minor things. Uh, the holes on the roof, they're annoying. Uh, so many jeeps, they're annoying. And I wish I could always get in that tank and drive it. Battlefield. Uh, yeah, that would be pretty handy, I'd say. And uh, what's in store next in the few weeks? I'm bringing you, I've got an ACR support setup that I recommend with the ballistic vests. Very, very good guys. If you do not know, you should definitely use them, as well as a recon drone. Now that's also pretty good. Uh, getting a bit off topic, sorry. Um, the difficulty in reaching the Osprey Gunner. Getting the attack helicopter is pretty hard, as well as between the attack helicopter and the AC-130. Uh, that's five kills. If you get one or two with the attack helicopter, well done. It can get shot down pretty fast. Fail knife right there. And and then once you've got the AC-130, you know, you just rain hell on those guys. It's really, really, really easy to get the Osprey Gunner from there. You just, it's absolutely beast. And if you did not know, assault kill streaks chain. So if you get a kill from the attack helicopter, it goes on to AC-130, which is very handy, I think. Um, some minor things about the AC-130. Um, I don't think I have many. It's just it's so, so zoomed out far. If you guys know how to zoom in, please let me know. Email us. Uh, attack helicopter, minor things. Doesn't have a flare. And most of the time it doesn't give you a kill, like it would rain down and you get a lot of shit markers. Um, Osprey Gunner, minor things, is the weaponry. It's got explosive rounds, but takes a bit to kill them. Uh, <laughs> it is funny, I pick up an MP5 custom, extender mags and silencer, and I think I use this all the way down to one bullet, because I don't have scavenger on. Anyway, um, another thing about the Osprey Gunner is it's such, since it's an Osprey, everyone sees it, and so you know everyone's firing at you and stuff. I was pretty lucky there, and so it has two flares, like the Escort airdrop. Here's another thing, guys: you can throw stuff, concussion grenades, frags, and stuff through those windows on the ladder, which is pretty handy, and explode those barrels at the start of the game. And so I'm one off the attack helicopter here. There we go. Call it in. And from here on in, guys, it's just, it's really easy for me. And so, sorry guys, getting back to the Osprey Gunner. Um, yeah, I think it's, it's very good by itself, I believe. But some minor things would be, of course, maybe getting a second gun on it. Like a much, like an explosive round like the AC-130 does. Um... I reckon for how big it is, it might be a little bit underrated. It's like, yeah, 17 kill streak, let's get it. And then you drop the care packages and you can get shot down or the game finishes in my case. And difficulty, it's, it's definitely something you guys should do. It makes you feel very, very good after getting it, might I just say. And most of the YouTubers say this, you know, it's... It's definitely a setup. Now, if you are a pro out there, you could go Reaper AC-130 Osprey. That would make it easy. Or if you're a noob and you just want to get it for fun, then I would recommend going uh, what I've done. Although it would be, you know, pretty hard. And so coming up to AC-130 here, this guy runs off, and I'm thinking, oh, where is he, where is he, where is he? I haven't had any ammo. Where, where is he, where is he? Oh, there he is, AC-130, and I've got one bullet left in the MP5. And now uh, this is good. You know. So it's got three weapons there. And the third one's just like a machine gun. You know, you can rain hell on them. Rain hell, rain hell, rain hell. You get so many double kills and multi-kills and triple kills. It's unbelievable. And, yeah, so the PP-90, if something was to kind of counteract it, I'd probably maybe say the MP-7, it's a bit overpowered, actually. That's why I use the P-90, 
Now they're pretty much the same, the P90 and the PP90, except for the fire rate. The PP does about 1,000 rounds per minute. Here we go, Osprey Gunner, and it finishes. <laughs> Very unlucky. I finished off 27 for 6, which, you know, isn't my best. But P90, it does good damage. It does better damage long range. And also, I don't know, I just feel like it doesn't have as much recoil. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Email us. And that will be a link in the description. I've got some great more stuff coming for you. And here's just the barracks now of what I've achieved. And so I'll be getting there, getting there. I got quite a lot of XP. I got some accolades. Oh, that's the team. That's the XP for the gun. Uh, here we go. Wait for it. Ah, uh, here we go. Strike package. Osprey gunner. I've called him one of the three and AC 130s I think that's say nine and attack helicopter that's the setup I use thanks for watching guys if you have emails if you have emails email us send in your best clips and stuff if you have fails also send them in and uh, peace